Welcome to the Resource Consumption Accounting Introduction Series, Part 1. This presentation is the first in a series of presentations introducing RCA and its principles that will create improved information for managerial decision making. I'm Larry White, the Executive Director of the Resource Consumption Accounting Institute. This presentation will describe RCA and present RCA's business objectives. Additional, additional webcasts will present RCA's principles and concepts, introduce you to the RCA model, and cover additional topics on resource consumption accounting. Where does RCA fit into your business? Your business has productive capacity and a competitive strategy. Every organization needs to continuously optimize its enterprise, taking great care to ensure the correct information is available to minimize cost and maximize revenue. These three components will create greater success in a highly competitive marketplace. RCA is the managerial costing approach focused on creating information for your enterprise optimization decisions. A financial accounting system reports historical results accurately. Effective managerial costing is needed to create the forward-looking information to improve tomorrow's results. To enhance your bottom line, you need to ensure that every manager and employee has the information to make correct decisions. Value is created inside your organization well before any capital market or investor decisions are made. RCA provides financial information clearly linked to operational data. And by operational data, we mean direct service or product producing operations and support functions. This yields clear decision-making power encompassing all aspects of your business, not limited by the design of your financial accounting systems, general ledger processes, and chart of accounts. RCA provides a compass to navigate your business, enabling more effective, forward-looking decision-making throughout your organization. So what is RCA? It combines German managerial accounting methods known as Grenzplan, Kost, and Rechnen, which translated directly means flexible cost planning and control. In English, we tend to refer to it as GPK. And a strict form of activity-based costing where detailed, pro where detailed process insights are needed. GPK is little known outside of German-speaking countries, but research by the Institute of Management Accountants Foundation for Applied Research has confirmed that it is in wide use in 3,000, in over 3,000 German companies. It was developed in the late 1940s by the same individual that developed the SAP controlling module and has been in use continuously and is widely taught in German universities. German companies have a function known as controlling, which is very different from the controller function in the United States. In Germany, controlling has nothing to do with financial reporting and is focused on the integration of operational and cost information for decision support. RCA creates an integrated economic model of operations for decision making. Because it is quantity based, it puts capacity issues in the forefront. RCA allows efficient forecasting, planning, and scenario analysis because it is a model based on operational resource flows. The only adjustments will be for real capacity constraints not to unravel complex cost allocations. RCA reflects the real characteristics of resources and processes. Is a resource divisible? 
what are the characteristics of a resource a resources consumption to produce an output because a RCA model is built by first modeling operational resource flows maintenance of the model will be much more straightforward than for accounting information that tries to derive cost information RCA is based on foundational principles for managerial costing causality and analogy RCA elevates the principle of cause and effect as its guiding principle, eliminating confusion between operational realities and cost data manufactured from a traditional general ledger. RCA applies the Institute of Management Accountants conceptual framework for managerial costing. Managerial costing is purely focused on internal decision support. It applies the principle of causality and its 10 supporting concepts to build an operational model. That is a model in non-financial quantities and then monetizes that model to reflect the resources. This model becomes the basis for optimization efforts through the logical use of information, which is the principle of analogy. RCA can be used to clearly connect operational and strategic information to a firm's value, value chain, both in primary activities and support activities. RCA eliminates the disconnect between operational and monetary information. Strategic, financial, and operational information becomes understandable throughout the organization. In July 2009, the International Federation of Accountants published an international good practice guide called Evaluating and Improving Costing in Organizations and a companion information paper titled Costing Levels Continuum Maturity Model. This chart is from the information paper, which was written by Gary Kokins. Resource consumption accounting was evaluated as the most sophisticated approach to costing, short of an ideal real-time simulation. This is the first in a series of podcasts on resource consumption accounting. If it has piqued your interest, I encourage you to listen to additional webcasts as they become available to learn more about how RCA delivers the results presented in this presentation. They are sequentially numbered and you will generally find listening to them in order to be your best approach. Please don't hesitate to contact me via the website, direct email, or by phone to discuss RCA or the RCA Institute. Thank you.